Hi everyone, it's Atum F. Young with Effie Fit, and I help busy professional women get fit and healthy using simple nutrition and exercise habits that fit into their schedule so that they can have energy from morning till night without the need for the 3 p.m. coffee or snack break. And today I wanted to talk to you about mindset around getting fit and healthy and losing weight. So it's important to have a good mindset when you're getting ready to make these um, changes to your lifestyle. So I think the first thing to remember is that you need to be doing this for yourself. So if you're doing it because of something you saw in the media or because hashtag Fitspo is all over your Instagram and you feel really bad about yourself, then you need to evaluate why you're making these changes. So if it's not for anything other than yourself, um, then you probably shouldn't be trying to lose weight or um, get fit. So that's the first thing, so make sure you're doing it for yourself and for no other reason. The second thing is to um, ditch the scale and not worry about what the numbers are saying. So don't get too caught up in what the numbers say. If you're starting to feel better and you're starting to look better in your clothes and you've got a ton of energy, then you're probably doing something really great and you should keep doing that. So think about other ways that you can track your um, progress and not just focus on the scale. Um, another thing to consider is have realistic goals. So it took time for you to get to where you are now and it'll take time for you to get to where you want to be. So just know that it's a process and it's gonna take time and if you want to be able to do it healthfully and to be able to maintain it, then um, that slow change over time is going to be much more worth it in the long run than the quick, I gotta lose 10 pounds this week. So make sure that you're keeping your goal realistic um, with what you want to achieve. And know that everyone's body is different, so we're not gonna all look the same. So also be very realistic about what your body is capable of. And then the very last thing is, you don't have to do this perfectly. So that consistent action is what's gonna get you the results. Um, being Trying to do it perfectly is just gonna make you go crazy. And then at the end of 30 days or 60 days, you're probably gonna go back to your old habits. So um, put those habits into place and do them consistently and know that if you have a donut one day, it's not the end of the world. Um, but just keep doing those things that are going to get you to where you wanna be consistently. And so with that, um, if you have any questions for me, um, you can find me over on Facebook or on Instagram, or if you are ready to get on with your own um, health and fitness uh, journey, then you can contact me directly and we can set up a free consultation to determine your needs and how we can best work together. Otherwise, I will be talking to you soon, and I hope that you have a very great day. Bye.